Solar Storm, the invisible threat that is weighing on our technological civilization in recent weeks, the world has been abuzz with news of an unprecedented solar event, the most significant solar storm in 20 years has just hit Earth. Although we have so far been fortunate to avoid the worst, scientists and astronomers are still on high alert. This storm is not a simple anomaly but part of a larger pattern that suggests we are in for even more turbulent times. The solar cycle, the most intense we have experienced in years, is still going strong, and it has brought with it a terrifying and worrying sign, a giant sunspot, reminiscent of the one that caused the historic disaster in the United States in 200 years ago, this giant sunspot, AR-3664, is the subject of close monitoring. Its growth and potential consequences have raised concerns about a repeat of historical disasters. If the stain continues to spread, Earth could face dire consequences. On the one hand, we could witness the awe-inspiring northern lights stretching across unprecedented latitudes. On the other, we could see catastrophic collapse of energy and communications infrastructure in a matter of minutes. Elon Musk, the famous CEO of SpaceX, has publicly expressed his concerns. On May 11, 2024, Elon Musk shared a disturbing image on social media, highlighting the strain that a recent solar storm had put on his Starlink satellite system. The storm and its intense particle flux pushed the satellite's defense mechanisms to their limits. While the technology survived the event, Musk warned that a more intense storm could overwhelm or even wipe out these advanced systems. The stakes are high, a more intense storm could disrupt the region's internet and cellular networks, or worse, leave us with skies full of disabled satellites. Elon Musk's warning underscores a larger problem that experts have long warned about. Solar storms are a vastly underestimated threat in the 21st century. These storms, caused by streams of particles from the sun, not only create fascinating auroras, but can also wreak havoc on our technology. The intricate dance of particles, charged by the sun's magnetic field, creates spectacular light shows, but these same particles can cause catastrophic disruption if they interact with our power and communication systems. The recent solar storm, the most intense in 20 years, created the spectacular northern lights, which were visible farther from the poles than usual. In the northern hemisphere, people saw beautiful colors in the sky, while in the southern hemisphere, areas north of the poles saw similar spectacles. These auroras, ranging from blue to red, were a visual testament to the storm's power. However, this colorful spectacle is a double-edged sword. The same solar activity that produces these spectacular lights can also cause severe geomagnetic storms that disrupt our technological infrastructure that we are currently in the middle of a solar cycle that lasts about 11 years and we are at its peak. This period, known as solar maximum, is characterized by extreme fluctuations in solar activity. The recent activity of sunspot AR-3664, which produced numerous X-type and M-type flares, is a striking illustration of the intensity of the cycle. Class X eruptions, among the most powerful, have been observed with alarming frequency, including the particularly violent X4.5 eruption. These eruptions are not just visually spectacular, they are important because they release large amounts of particles that can reach Earth almost instantly, causing potential disruption. Sunspot AR-3664 has attracted a lot of attention due to its size and activity. At its peak, it was so large that it was visible from Earth through eclipse glasses. This sunspot, 15 times larger than Earth, has been responsible for a number of violent solar storms that have affected not only Elon Musk satellites but also other technologies. Sunspot activity is a source of concern because it could lead to more intense storms, similar to those observed in 2003 that the solar maximum we are experiencing is notable for its unexpected intensity. The current solar cycle has peaked earlier than expected, raising alarms about possible anomalies in the sun's behavior. Some scientists speculate that the sun's magnetic field could reverse, leading to more frequent and intense geomagnetic storms. This scenario mirrors the intensity of the 2003 Halloween storms, which were classified as G5 and caused widespread disruption. The historic Carrington event of 1859 is a stark reminder of the potential devastation a solar storm can cause. Named after British astronomer Richard Carrington, 
the event was the most powerful solar storm on record. Observed from August 28 to September 2, 1859, the Carrington event produced a bright solar flare that was visible to astronomers. The ensuing geomagnetic storm caused spectacular auroras across the globe, from Europe to the Southern Hemisphere. In the United States, the storm caused significant disruption to telegraph systems, sparks, and fires. The technology at the time was primitive by today's standards, so the impact was relatively limited, however, if a similar event were to occur in today's technology-dependent world, the consequences would be much more severe. Modern satellites, power grids, GPS systems, and communications infrastructure are vulnerable to the type of intense solar activity characteristic of a Carrington event. The economic damage could be huge, running into trillions of dollars. Failure of navigation systems could lead to major accidents and disasters, especially in the aviation and shipping industries. The Carrington event demonstrated that solar storms, while not directly dangerous to humans or nature, can have serious impacts on our technological systems. The Earth has probably experienced thousands of such storms throughout its history. Solar activity, including solar flares and coronal mass ejections, CMEs, is an integral part of the Sun's normal behavior. These events can range from small flares to large flares that eject large amounts of magnetized plasma into space. The 1859 storm was exceptional in its speed and intensity, with the CME reaching Earth in less than 20 minutes, a truly rare event although potentially devastating, solar storms also play an important role in our solar system. They contribute to space weather, shape our climate, and protect us from cosmic rays by forming the heliosphere. Without these particles, life on Earth might not exist due to the intense radiation from space. To reduce the risks posed by solar storms, it is essential to improve and protect our technology. Modern satellites are designed to withstand space weather to some extent, but many systems are still outdated and vulnerable. Governments and utilities are working to develop new technologies and strategies to protect power grids and other critical infrastructure. Historical events such as the 1989 geomagnetic storm that caused widespread power outages in Canada highlight the need for continued vigilance and preparation. In space, the stakes are even higher. Satellites and the International Space Station, ISS, face significant risks from solar particles. Even minor malfunctions in space can quickly become life-threatening. As a result, organizations like NASA and private companies like SpaceX are closely monitoring solar activity and preparing for potential disruptions. The threat of a major solar storm remains ever-present and highly likely. As we continue to advance technologically, we must also improve our preparedness and resilience to these cosmic threats. The risk of a repeat of historical disasters is a stark reminder of the need to remain vigilant and proactive in protecting our technological infrastructure against the unpredictable forces of the sun.